हेलो फ्रेंड्स लेट्स सी वन वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन व्हाट इज सिंबॉलिक ए एंड व्हाट इज नॉन सिंबॉलिक ए आई सो लेट्स ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस थिंग विथ वन वेरी फेमस एग्जांपल ऑफ चाइनीज सर्ल एक्सपेरिमेंट सर्ल्स चाइनीज रूम एक्सपेरिमेंट सॉरी सो सर्ल सर्ल इज वन ऑफ द प्रोफेसर एट आई थिंक यू सी बर्कले यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ कैलिफोर्निया बर्कले सर्ल्स Chinese room experiment. So, what is the Chinese uh, Searle's Chinese room experiment? So, Chinese room experiment is that there is a one agent is sitting behind the wall, behind inside the room, and from that room, inside that that room, either machine will exist or either one human is exist. And the task is let's define the task first of all. and with respect to this example we'll try to understand what is symbolic ai and what is non symbolic ai and we'll try to differentiate that what are the different fundamental approaches behind this symbolic ai and a non symbolic ai so task is to translate text from english to chinese so what is that experiment is that thought, this is one of the thought experiment the idea is that you have one room and inside that one room either machine exist or any human is sitting we don't know what is that and there is a one window in from that you supply the english text st statement and that machine program which exists inside that room or either human exists inside that room it will translate this sentence of english is into a chinese now inside that room there might exist a lot of knowledge related to english statement and lot of knowledge related to uh, english language and a chinese language and there is a mapping between individual word which we say in english mapping to corresponding word in a chinese so the idea is that it will just translate it and give give to us so that is nothing but the symbolic ai so let's try to differentiate with respect to this example one is sim symbolic ai and another is a non symbolic ai so let's say we want to translate this text from english to chinese with respect to symbolic ai approach so what we have available we have a full room inside that one machine program or a human sorry actually it's uh, disconnecting okay we can continue one room is there and inside that one room one machine program or a human exists we don't know what is that actually and there is a huge bunch of data related to english language and a chinese language is available and a mapping from individual word of english to chinese is available now we supply the english statement or english text to this room and inside that whatever this machine program or humans are available it will continuously scan whole those text is available in english and corresponding text is available in chinese it will translate it and give us so that is what the idea behind the symbolic ai that you are trying to represent everything in a symbolic form all english language sentence all english uh, chinese language sentence and is mapping from corresponding word in a english to the corresponding word in a uh, chinese so you are trying to represent everything in a symbolic uh, way and it will just uh, translate it but while translating it has to scan through every single english 
statement whatever the tax we have supplied based on that once it finds the english statement it will try to find the corresponding chinese statement or a chinese uh, a word it will club it and it will give us but there is a might be possibility of uh, erroneous uh, Uh, translation also might exist because it doesn't uh, know the context behind it what is the intention behind this particular sentence it is something like a look up table that is symbolic ai system has a huge bunch of predetermined look up tables are available from english word to the chinese word and it will just translate it now let's say we want to solve this problem with the non symbolic ai so we are not trying to represent any particular english uh, uh, english word to the chinese word mapping or kind of but the same way we have available room we have another machine program which will behave like a non symbolic ai uh, way or either human will exist so in non symbolic ai what we try to do we have all those english text as a input data or a chinese text as a input uh, training data for us and a mapping between english and chinese we are trying to represent or we are trying to model this system so when we give, supply the new english statement to this machine or to this non symbolic ai uh, system it just uh, do not need to search or scan through every single word or every single statement available in english it just straight away translate it just straight away translate it and give us so for that it's like a training plus testing system that machine is trying to or non symbolic ai kind of system is trying to understand that what english statement is what chinese statement is and it is trying to understand the differences between english and a chinese so whenever the new english statement is available it just straight away uh, translate it and it will uh, give us so that is nothing but a non symbolic ai system neural network uh, regression classification kind of algorithm and then regression kind of machine learning algorithm lies in a non symbolic ai kind of uh, system that it will try to take the input data as a training it will build a model and when the new data will come it will apply those new data on those particular model and it just straight away translate it while in case of symbolic ai it has a huge knowledge base and it just try to map from one english word to the another english word and it will form the uh, translation so we are not trying to represent anything in a symbolic way in a non symbolic ai whereas in a symbolic ai it is just kind of a look up table so that's the basic difference between a symbolic ai and a non symbolic ai system i hope you understand uh, about the symbolic ai and a non symbolic ai differences if you have known any more example just write down into comment uh, and uh, we'll try to explore more about the uh, how you can look at the same system or you can approach the artificial intelligence system from the symbolic ai approach or a non symbolic ai approach i hope you enjoy listening this video uh, please do like comment and uh, subscribe my channel and at last thank you guys for the watching